Hey guys, this is Tim. Just going to show you real quick one of the new features that we implemented this winter is our chat support. So clients can chat the help desk and we can help them that way to answer their questions. A couple ways that they can initiate the chat. First one is by uh, clicking on this chat support here. Also on our technology page we have a, a chat support link here. And they can also simply go to chat.cell.edu. So from your end, when you first log into the help desk computer, you're going to get this pop-up here to log into the, it's called the representative console. This is, will be where you receive the chats and communicate with the clients. So you're going to log in with help desk blue, password that I'll, I'll tell you. You can check, remember, login info to make it easy in the future. So you click login and that's going to show uh, this screen here. And we'll show you what that looks like when someone wants to chat. So when you're in they'll see that there's a representative available here. They'll give uh, their name and their issue. So they're going to submit that. And some browsers you can connect right away. A lot of them you have to download this little little agent here. So they'll just have to download that. It gives instructions here. You're about to start. Run the file that just downloaded. If it doesn't download, click there. Got some canned information here. All right. So once they run that, they'll see this. They'll see a little thing here. It's a secure connection. Rezep representative will be with you shortly. It's maybe recorded. Blah 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 blah. So as soon as they're there, they're sitting there waiting to to talk to the help desk. And on your end, you'll see pop up down here, new session, and you'll see a queue here. Someone sitting there waiting to to chat. So you just want to double click on that. That's going to start the chat. And you'll see here on their end, you're now chatting with Technology Help Desk Blue. So here's the chat window here. You just say, hey, how can I help you today? Very simple log up here. And you'll see on their end, basic chat here. Once the problem's done, make sure that they say goodbye. And right now what you're going to want to do is copy copy that chat log. Open up a new email and just make sure that you make a ticket with that information. Um, at some point soon we're going to have this this automated so that you don't have to to do this, but for now um, For now, we just want to do this so we have uh, have those records. So launch that off to the help desk. We'll close that out um, soon. As soon as you close this here, you'll just want to click on end session. Once we get this integrated into Case, at that point, that will send a session log to to Case. So once you close that session, this is what they'll see on their end. Thanks for using it. Blah 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 blah. And uh, you just sit back and wait, wait for the next one. So again, you just want to make sure that you run this every time. You logged in, it should automatically start. If it doesn't, there's a shortcut on the desktop. If it's not there, ask me as well. Uh, we're just using the chat feature right now. Pretty simple. Wait for someone to come into the queue. Chat them here when you're done. Copy the log, paste it into an email, send it to the help desk. Hit the uh, red X and the session. All right, I'll let you know once that log is automated, but for now that's that's the whole process and we want to be doing this every time you're you're on shift at the desk. All right, thanks guys. If you have any more questions, let me know. But for now, that's uh, what we're going to go forward with. All right.